So in order to make these earrings, you are going to need some flat nose pliers, some flush cutters, a shepherd hook, a crimp cover, crimp bead, and some beading thread, as well as your gemstones. So let's get started. This is what we call a ladder weave. And if I hold it up here, you'll be able to see because we have certain rungs of our ladder here this is what we're going to kind of achieve with our weave so what I'm going to do first is just take some of our beading thread now on our beading thread here I don't know if you can see there's a little notch just like so always pop your beading thread through there before you cut because then it's going to prevent it from unraveling which is a really really good tip so if I just take some of this I'm just going to take about 12 inches and then as you can see here I'm just going to pop that straight back into that little notch and cut there and then we're ready to go for the next time. So we've now got our beading thread. I'm going to take three of our gemstones and thread these on. So we're just going to thread three of our gemstones on and they're going to allow them to drop down to the centre of our thread. Let's move that out of the way. So now we have got our three. So I'm going to take my fourth bead and with the fourth bead and the thread through the right hand side thread but then we're also going to thread through on the opposite direction the left hand side. So then we're left with something that looks a little bit like that. Now what we're going to do is you want to kind of try and keep these two lengths at an equal distance. So you don't want one longer than the other, in other words. So we're just going to kind of bring that all together bit by bit until we've got our cross or square, however you want to look at it. So now we're going to add on two more beads, one on the left one on the right, so I'm going to add one onto the left and one onto the right and as you can hit see here we've kind of created a little bit of a, a triangle shape so we're just going to take one more 